And now we'll talk about water pressure. And this is something you have probably all experienced. When you dive to the bottom of a pool, especially if you dive down in the deep end, you can feel the pressure on your ears. And you've probably noticed that the deeper you dive, the greater the pressure is. And the reason you can feel it on your ears is because your eardrums are sensitive to the outside pressure. Let me just draw a simplistic picture here. You feel the pressure on your eardrums. Here's your ear. And down inside your ear is the eardrum. And basically sound waves coming through the air, hit the, they go into your ear and they hit the eardrum and make it vibrate. And there's uh, little pieces of tissue and um, nerves attached that can detect those vibrations and signals flow through the nerves into your brain and your brain interprets those signals as sound. But the eardrum has to be able to vibrate and it's called an eardrum for that reason. If you were to magnify this point, just a, a real simplistic picture. It's um, this membrane stretched tight right here, kind of like the surface of a drum. So think of that surface that I shaded there just a little bit as the surface of a drum. So there has to be air on each side. There's this cavity here in back, and there's air. So there's air over here on the left side and air over here on the right side inside that cavity. And that allows this surface to vibrate back and forth it can li literally shake back and forth what, what would be left and right in this diagram because there's room on both sides for it to move. And so because there's air on this side, when you dive down deep, the water pressure on the outside pushing in pushes it and there's room for this membrane to stretch here toward the inside. And it hurts a little bit and you can feel it. But that's why you feel it on your ears and not on other places. For example, the same pressure exists on your arm, but it's squeezing on your arm, but there's not a empty space on the inside of your arm for your arm to collapse or for parts of your arm to distort into. Your arm, basically, the tissues in your arm exert the same pressure out, but there's no tissue behind the eardrum to exert the same pressure out. That's why you feel it specifically on your ears and not on other places. But if you've done this, if you've uh, have, have dived to the bottom of a pool, you have experienced this. Greater depth means greater pressure. And that's an important general principle. As you go down deeper, you experience greater pressure. You can see this if you were to take a, a, a tin can, say a tall can, something like this. And you can draw this over here in your notes. So imagine a tall can, and it's filled with water. And the lid is open. It's open on the top. And suppose you were to punch a hole in the side here, and another hole here, and another hole here. And you were to open all three of those holes at the same time. Well, water would start leaking out all three of those holes. But it would leak out the, the top hole, something like this, and would spill down here, here and probably splatter. On the bottom hole, it would squirt out something like this. Or on the middle hole, something like this. And then on the bottom hole, it might squirt something like this. Okay, and the reason you get those different paths is from different amounts of pressure. The water pressure, gravity is literally pulling down on the water. But down below, there's more water up above, so there's more weight of water pushing down on the water on the bottom so the water on the bottom is under higher pressure. So it squirts out the hole with more force and at a higher speed. So the stream of water shoots out a longer distance at the bottom than it does at the middle or at the top where there's relatively little pressure. And you can actually see this if you set up a can like this and let the water squirt out. You can actually see evidence of different pressure at different depths. And you can specifically see that at greater depth there's greater pressure.